Hello and welcome back to what should be the final episode of the Final Fantasy Pixel Remaster for PC. And right in front of us is Tiamat. We... No, I'm sorry, I clicked out to start recording. Oh, here. The Lich, Maracliff, the Kraken! You have defeated the three fiends and reached my lofty perch! <laughs> it's green farts come out. I am the Fiend of Wind! All the better. May the image of Tiamat, the fiend of wind, be the last to burn your eyes. Oh, my eyes are burning. Just keeps farting ferociously. So Tiamat's a bit of a bastard. Um, you may remember. Mm -mm -mm. Ow, 252 damage just with... Just for free. Don't worry, this guy will pepper your corns. Uh, I'm going to risk no alling myself and going with a haste on you. Kind of the same strategy that we were using um, with Warmech. And there goes the magic. Don't kill, don't kill, cool. Why does no all miss? Right, you need to heal. Uh, Hilaga, please. And you now have uh, the ability to use the powerful flare. Pa, 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 Didn't even need it, bro. Pa, 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 pa. Do you see what I mean? Do you see what I mean at the end of the last episode? Do you see what I mean? This could be a 15 minute episode if we don't try. Do you see what I mean? I look at Tiamat. Brazy fellow. A breezy fellow, bruv. All right, we've got to throw our little um, apple-flavoured uh, Jolly Rancher at the crystal. There he goes, mmm, delicious flavour. Just restored. There we go. How much leave? Do you want to leave? Hell yeah, I want to leave. I need to heal him by ethers, bro. What the hell do you mean? Uh, 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 also, yeah, I probably want to turn the cows off. <laughs> we had enough of encounters with that war mech, bro. That was a super boss, and I don't want to ever see it again. Uh, right, so first thing we want to do uh, is go heal up. So, to Cornelia, I guess. Yeah. Easiest place to heal up, right? Um, this is like right here. So we're going to save and slap. We're going to do a quick trip to make sure that we have the best equipment and magic that we can physically have. All right, so the end game places would be Lutheria for magic, wouldn't it? Lutheria, Gaia, um, and then the, the, the Oxiel place. I mean, why couldn't we just land here? No, you got to land all the way up here because the game's like, haha, now you're going to have to walk 50 miles and have 79 different encounters on the way. Mm. I'm just like, thank you very much, sir. I also have to play a mini game for an achievement and I haven't done it. I mean, the only reason I'm doing the Bistiri is for the achievement to have the Bistiri done. Um, so we're going to ignore these people and we're going to go back over here. The magic shop, so make sure that we have all the magic we can buy. You, uh, full life we already have, unfortunately. We got $700,000. Flare we already have, right? We got everything this town has to offer. Fair enough, on to Gaia. Whoop. Also, I'm gonna have to look up if we can get, is the Masamune in here? Or is it just the Sasuke Blade? Oh, the Masamune might be in the final dungeon. So I'm, I'm overlooking the fact that there is a final dungeon to do and it's still got loot in it. All right, over here. All right, let's go to Gaia. Guys, just up here. Yeah, yeah. Um, right. Doing the black magic. <coughs> He's got that. He doesn't have break. Don't really care about having break, though, to be honest. Um, 
I don't know if there's another option though, because sometimes they give you four. Kuraja we have, Diaja we have. Uh, there was another set of shops up here. So let's have a look in here. What do you have? Stop we have, whoop, we don't have, kill we don't have. Uh, I mean, I mean, certainly kills an enemy. Let's use, well, it's, it's on the same level as stop and flare. I don't know, warp, I guess. I mean, I don't even need it for 40 grand. Why am I spending 40 grand on magic I don't even want? You know what I mean? Holy, yes, we've already got that. Null or dispel. We can't learn dispel, though. That's fine. We might need dispel to be honest for the final boss. I don't know. I'm not using that much of a guide. Um, right, you, welcome. What do you have? Ruby armlet, terrible. Protect ring, we've already got. That's fine, my sir. What do you have? Cat claws, only cat claws. Okay, let's leave you. Uh, na, 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 na. This place is shit. Um, it's just on rack, isn't it? And if there's nothing in on rack, then oh well. That's it. <laughs> Final boss time, right? And again, we can't park our ship here. We gotta park it all the way down there. Because when this super advanced people who built apparently who looked like angels and built a flipping flying fortress with war mechs in it they were like oh, we can't build a ship airship that has, like a helicopter boat that lands anywhere that would be uh, too much we got to... well, i don't think we can buy anything else to be fair right what do you want again we can't it's that like null death enhances the party's offense is death i don't know would that be nice to have? I think I've got everything I want, to be fair. Saber and blind, he can learn these. Raise attack and accuracy, blinds an enemy. I'll get saber, why not? I don't like any of the other shit. We've got nothing to spend it on. I mean, we can buy items, but we've got nothing to spend it on otherwise. Let's go buy some items, I guess. What you got? Uh, all right, let's buy ethers. No, no, ethers for 14,000. There you go. More than enough money for that. 14 grand. Or was that 140 grand? Either way. I think it was 140 grand. We still got 680 grand. <laughs> okay. Where else can I go? I mean, the Desert Bazaar doesn't sell anything. The Waterfall Cave doesn't sell anything. Uh, Bahamut's place doesn't sell anything. There's no shop in the Mirage Tower. I mean, what would be the next late? There's no later shop than that, right? All this Northern Continent shops I've gone to. Like, the next shop would be, like, all the way back in Waterfall Cavern or something. Oh, guess we're done. Now, for the final boss, they do recommend you be level 50. We are pretty much 45. Um, so, should we... I mean, I say, should we gain some levels? But I don't think we actually bloody need to. So let's park our thing here and save the game. Because uh, you may notice uh, from my last file where I beat the game, as you can see at the start, I was level 47. So it is doable at 47. Um, I'm thinking, should I do the little um, ship mini game? Let me Google how you do it. We'll get on our ship to do it. I may as well get an achievement while we're doing this because I'll show you how to do it as well. So we need to go to our ship, which is located down here. And I'm not stalling. It's just literally we go into the Chaos Shrine and we go down a couple floors and we're done. Um, so we just get on our ship and we hold enter and we press back a couple times.
There we go. Play 15 puzzle. Um. Oh no, 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 no. Simply open is not. The older versions of this puzzle let you get gill and consumable items. PC Remaster does not give you anything. I mean, there's no guide on what, what am I supposed to be doing? Like, what, what am I doing? I, I don't get it. it just goes down it. Oh, it's like, I am terrible at these games, so I'm just gonna quit. Yes. I guess I got my achievement. I don't know, nothing came up. Alright, final dungeon time it is. What's the close I can just I was say what's the closest I can get there? Here we go. Oh there we go, it just popped up. Played the 15 puzzle game. Thank god that I don't get coins for that because that would be shit. Um Right, let's save again outside. Now that I've beaten that arduous task. And get ready to pound some ass. Uh, right, in here we go. Now you may remember this thing. Do you know what we've got to do to it? We take our Jolly Ranchers, the four shining crystals, fire, earth, water, and wind on the black crystal. The flow of time surges and space begins to warp. Just one step forward, and you'll travel back 2,000 years in time. Take me back, I wanna go back. Right, welcome to the Chaos Shrine. We're here. Um, I'm standing there so I can actually see the map. Right. There's a stairs down over there. Over there, over there goes up, and over there goes up. So I wanna go, let's go up, I guess. Oh, this place isn't derelict no more, so you have to actually go across it properly. Ooh. There's nothing to do here but go up more, okay. Uh -huh. So the bosses I need to, well bosses, the characters, the two mysterious characters I need to find for this is on the second floor, which is this, isn't this the second floor or is this the third floor? Well, hold up, let me go back down. Second floor. So let's do F3 off and let's save the game and see if we can find ourselves a little bread drink called Ryos. There's Ryos. <laughs> Should I? Yeah, let's just defend, why not? I don't see these guys being too hard, right? Eh. Stone gas. <laughs> there goes Rios. They say Rios is down. Uh, we can turn the cows off. We got against Arios. Uh, we have one more encounter to get, which is in the basement floor. Um, right, where do I go here? Dead end. Dead end. Dead end. Dead end. And there's a thing in the middle. Duh. I took a screenshot again somehow. I don't know how. Apology. Yo, it's me. It's me. It's Big Smelly PP. Do I want to fight this guy? I guess so. Hello, bro. It's Death Eye. Um, the Arjo, I guess you're a dead and undead. I, I don't know if you count as an undead. Uh, I'm the Farag, are you? Oh, you died already? Okay. Sorry. What's this? I don't know what I just did. Someone's playing the loop, bro.
Um, I don't know what that did. I don't want to go down there if that leads to the final boss. I'm not going down there just now because this kind of seems like... Oh, I've got to fight this penis again. Hold on. I don't want to waste my magic. Just kick his ass. Take his lunch money. Go home. You know, normal shit. I don't want to go the right way. I think you don't understand this. I don't want to go... I want to go the wrong way because the wrong way is where all the goodies are. Because that'll take me down there. So I want to go the wrong way, which means I want to actually go down, which is over here. Oh, can we not go down? Is that the trick? Hold up. Have I been a dickhead this whole time? I have. Yeah, you can't go there, because look, this one's blocked. To go up here. This middle one's blocked. And then this one. Ah, so I... Mm, sometimes my own stupidity is... Astounding. No, you can tell I'm not using the guide at least. <laughs> How did you manage to fuck that up? Because I'm stupid, Vegeta. <laughs> Trust me though, being able to run and having... Oh, I've got to fight this penis again and take his lunch money. Oh, he gets a turn this time. Alright, bro. Bye bye. Yeah. <laughs> He gave me like one XP. What a tight fisted prick. What a cunt. Uh, right, map. So there's nothing here. There's nothing in there. There's nothing in there. And there's nothing in there. So where the fuck am I supposed to go? Am I, am I just supposed to go to that thing in the top corner? Why do I feel like I'm getting bamboozled, bro? Oh, okay, we come over here. Basement floor four. Once we get there, then we're okay. Until we get there, no. Um, can't go down the middle because there's blocks there. There's a stairs. Oh, there's a lich, I guess, just blocking my way. All right, lichy. Okay, so we can't go here or there. All right, I guess we're fighting the lich. You guys ready? Okay, he doesn't even speak. No. Damn you, he man. I'm just gonna fuck you up, my boy. I am super powerful. You will never defeat me. Meh. Ow. Stop hitting me, you fool. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna defend now. I think you're done, bro. The warp. My bow killed him. Don't finish him right now. Thank you, sir. Don't. Can you, can you stop? All right. You attack. You. Actually, wait, no. You use the Phoenix down on your brother. You. I want you to cast Hilaga. And I want you to cast Faraga on this piece of shit. For sending him into flipping... That was supposed to go off after the item game. Oh, I love it. All right, can you kill him, please? Uh. Making this take longer than it needs to, bro. Can you please die? Right. Uh, 
Um, no, I just eat flat. All right, he died anyway. <laughs> I was like, should I bring the guide up that shows me how much HP he's got, or should I be, should I be worried at all? I like how they go. This boss is easy. You abuse high end spells such as the Dia based ones, and the boss should be down within a few turns. Head downstairs after easily winning. Thank, you. thank you, thank you, sir. So like he just used warp that's an insta kill. Um, didn't buy any potions. Okay. Uh, um, actually, no, he's just hit him up with that. I think that's fine. Anyway, go downstairs. Remember basement five. Oh look, there's Marilith. I guess we would know where we're going. Let's just check the old map. Can't go anywhere there. Can't go anywhere there. Wait, so where the fuck are we supposed to go then? Do we just walk through the walls here or something? Because <laughs> there's blocks blocking everything. Hold up. Do we just walk through the walls? Is that, where do we go? From here. Ah, there's a door here. Okay, that... That helps. I didn't even see that. Any chests? Nope. Alright. That's fine. Wait, I didn't... Because there is a door there, but it doesn't go anywhere. Oh, I see. Sneaky little biscuit. Protect ring. Oh, I didn't see you there, did you, you little biscuit? You little chocolate digestive redder. So another Sasuke's blade. Um, I guess the reason that there's multiple Sasuke's blades is because you could have more than one ninja. Although there's only one Excalibur, so like, oh, well, if you want to be a hero. Oh, what's over here? Oh, what's over here? A protect cloak. Nice. And an elixir is pretty good. Elixir is pretty good for the final boss. Oh, heal. If we do get spanked up, which is very likely. Um, all right, Marilith. I'm just reading. Um, where's Marilith? It doesn't even say. It just goes Marilith. Gives you its stats. You know. HP, attack, defense, accuracy, magic defense, evasion, agility, intelligence, weaknesses, resistance, gill, XP. It gives you one gill, by the way, and drops. And it just says, head downstairs after this fight. Not even that how to, just, bro, just go downstairs, bro. Right, you're gonna attack, you're gonna attack. You are going to use Noble Blaze, probably, and you are going to use Flare. She's got 3,400 health and we've done about 200 of it. Why are we missing with magic like that? I don't understand. It's fine, I guess. Ow. Right, next magic, I want you to do Potaro. I want you, I didn't see how much Flare did. Uh, haste our big boy. There's the Farago, at least one of them got fucking protected. Not gonna help that much. Do that for when she does her regular swordy swords. That's nice. Uh, you can just Hilara everyone, it should be fine. And um, then can you temper him please? 800 damage, as you do. She'll be dead next turn, I think anyway, she's only got 3,400 health. How quit it. That just increases his physical attack strength. Has a tradition. Um, no, you don't need to do anything. Just defend. You can defend as well, to be honest. Bye bye. Oh, she lived on it. She lived it. She lived it. I like how Robin, who has the fire defense, actually gets the kill and has the least HP. He's like, 
I'm protected from fire, but I'm also almost dead. All right, Bridget. All right, Bridget. Oh, one gill. One gill like it even matters. Basement free. Let's see what we got. Do 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 do. There's stairs. Let's go in this door and see what happens. Right, if we go in this door, before we go out that door, there's a thing in the middle that I don't know what that is. That's just to get in the outside. There's three gravestone things in there? There's no chest though. So we try and go in the two middle bits. What's, what's in there? Um, absolutely nothing apparently. Uh, 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 uh. What are these? Nothing apparently. <laughs> Stairs are over here. Uh, come on, you but Use Kira, let's get you all back up. Fine. And then let's use items, sort by item. Oops, and let's use the 99 ethers we got. Oh, they could learn spells. I just noticed they can, he can learn the first three spells and he can learn four spells. Maybe I should have got some spells. Probably shouldn't be doing that, but. SpongeBob. What does it say about the Kraken? This boss is built like a tank, but it should still be no problem with a relatively good level team. I pretty much auto attack while my white wizard is healing the party. Head downstairs after winning. It has no weaknesses, by the way. Uh, I'm with a Protaro. And I'm going to haste the strongman. Okay, he used electricity. Cool. Uh, he's got 3,600 health, by the way. Um. Let's try that, why not? Uh, temper the big boy. Ow. 14 damage. Missed three people. It's missing everyone but our, um, our ninja, so that's, uh, that's very helpful. Uh, let's just heal Argar. And then let's temper you. Ooh, very nice. Ow, 300 damage, very nice. Thank you, sir. Good thing I've got a Hilaga coming. But. Right, all you need to do, Hilara, and you just need to put haste on this guy, and we win. Right. Well, we've been last turn, but apparently not. Uh, you can just defend, to be honest. Uh, you. Well, you finished powering everyone up, so I guess uh, let's just flare him. Eight hits for 100, even with a Patera. I think you can multiple Patera in this game, by the way, and like stack protection, but. Purple Tip Head doesn't really need it. Tiamat 2 is going to be a bitch. He had 80 defense and 200 magic defense, by the way. Um, oh. Oh. I read ahead. Um. So, this is where the Iron Golems show up. Um, and if you go down here, 
Surprise, surprise. It's Masamun. Or Masamune, however you pronounce it. Um, Bon Sasuke, bro. 69 in power. Ah, uh, yeah. Compared to 63 attack. We got 63 attack. <coughs> Make sure we're optimal right now. Okay, there we go. Right, now we've got that. I'm ready, it'll be optimal, mate. Um, let's have a look at the old map. That's a dead end, that's a dead end. So it's just literally to go to those stairs. You can't go that way. Sorry mate, can't go that way. Right, so we are going to quick save again and try and see if we can get our brethren uh, the Iron Golem. I'm guessing he's one of them bodybuilder types. That six air element was. Now, this should be fine. This is basically like when we were grinding before. This should be very fine. I mean, say grinding, because then we were looking for the Psycho Demon and the uh, War Mech. Whoa, that just done a thousand damage with his uh, Masamun. Jesus, man. I know one of the achievements I don't have is open all the chests, but I don't know what chests I'm missing. There we go, legendary collector, tre little treasure. I think I didn't get the mass moon before then. Mass moon must have been the one I was missing. I'm the legendary treasure collector. Oh, whoa. Oh, whoa. I think then the only thing I have to do is beat. No, I have to, what was it? Beat the Berseria, do all the Berseria, I've done 100% the game. <laughs> So these encounters are just chop masala though to be fair, so sort of like there you go. Yeah, if they're gonna level up. I'm not my I'm not I'm not moaning if they're gonna level up, you know what I mean? Stone golems? We want iron golem though. Defend and defend. I want to see. Okay, these guys look like they're going to need to be magically here. Are they magically weak? Not really. Um, where's Hill? Where's Hill? Try a Hill, defend. Oh, there we go. 4,000 gil, which is completely useless. Because what am I gonna, I could have just bought 90, 99 potion. Dragon zombies, okay. You know what, you can use magic, right? <laughs> The archer all these boys and defend. Hmm. Reasonable damage. Whee! There you go, you got to see the archer. Uh let's heal him up though. One thing, let's heal him up. Yeah. Come on, Iron Golem. Iron Golem. Wrong kind of Golem. Yeah, they're mincemeat this time. What is that up all about? Why are they mincemeat now? Come on, bro. Uh, 
I'm just gonna do the same thing. You know what? I can't really be bothered. Wee wee wee! This is the last. The last thing we have to get is the Iron Golem. Why is this going on? I'm gonna Google it. I wanna see what it says. The Iron Golem is an enemy from the original and subsequent version of Fantasy. The Sturgis of Golems in the original version is extremely rare. Found in the Chaos Shrine, it has a 1.6 chance of being... 1.6% chance of being encountered. Oh, your mum snorts crap out of my asshole. Are you buzzing? War Mech is supposed to be a super rare boss at 4%. This brethren is 1.6% chance of spawning. Oh. Uh. Uh. It's only on this floor as well. We're gonna do a couple battles. I mean, I could make a dick joke, but I think it's just a bit too bait with these guys to be fair. I don't trust you guys because the ones that you I fought in the desert off camera use earthquake and can insta kill people. So I kind of want to get rid of my purple one. Oh, he just lived that, didn't he? He just casually lived that, didn't he? I was gonna say like stop biting me, but you know what? I'd rather they bite me than use quake. Purple-headed worm. Again, we're still gaining levels. I mean, 46 is now across the board. And there's Tiamat right there. I ain't got him. I ain't, I ain't, I ain't got him. I ain't got him. If I don't find it within the next two and a half minutes, I'm going to pause the episode until I find this son of a bitch. Because this is the final episode. Because all we're going to do is fight Tiamat, walk across the next floor and fight the final boss and the game is over. So I'll give it three minutes because the game, there's probably like 10 minutes of gameplay left at best. Unless I fuck up and then I have to redo a boss. That's what quick savings for. Um, I mean, my argument is it's good grinding because you should technically be level 50 for the final boss, but um, we can't always do that, so. Hey, hey, hey. Why am I fighting these guys again? Okay. 47. I'm getting stronger by kidding all of your friends. All right. I don't think you're like 7,000 experience of fight. A minute and a half left to show up. Oh God, my wiener's back out. Um. They're just one-shotting them. I don't understand this game sometimes. Was that one level the difference? They're one-shotting them now. Like I know he leveled up, but still, Jesus. Third, thirteen thousand experience. Finally. Oh, the mind player's back. I mean, if they can't insta-kill, like they don't have an insta-death move, like warp or something. I don't see that mind. Uh, the next fight is going to be the last fight on camera that you're going to see before I skip to when the Iron Golem shows up. Unless I lose my patience and, you know, go crazy. I don't know. Something might happen. I want to say, if that showed up, that would be pretty sick, but we might get one more in. There's still 20 seconds until I'm going to stop. All right, one more. That's so all I'm going to do it up to the 40 minute mark. All right, no. No. I'll show the end of this battle. And then I'm going to pause. Because I've been sitting here for 40 minutes. So uh, I want that 20 minutes to fight the final two enemies in the game. The game would be so kind to do that for me. Wee! <laughs> 
probably should take you on. It's just taking a little longer because they paralyzed my warrior, but anyway. The power of Jesus compels you. There we go. I'm gonna quick save here. Not that I want to abuse it or anything, and I'm gonna pause. And hopefully, when I come back, you will see some iron golems, or see me going incredibly angry and swearing about why I couldn't find them and going to fight Tiamat. Either way, please hold. Finally, the iron golem has come back home. Anyway, <laughs> enough of that. Um, didn't take that long actually. It probably took about like. 10 minutes. Um, not too bad. Uh, uh, I don't know what he's weak to. I'm just gonna heal up a little bit and hope he dies. There we go. Viseri complete. Nice. And there we go. You've heard that little dilling. You can't see it because it's an overlay. And I'm capturing directly the game. But there we go, I beat it. Hey team up. Oh, I'm a big dragon. So we're gonna use the same strategy as before. Um Proterra. Haste this man. Ass storm. Um. Ow. He doesn't really use physical attacks, but I'm just double Patara in because if he does physically attack, it's going to be plus two defense. And this guy has 5,000 HP. Um, you can just Hilara now. You can temper him. 420 Blaze. Yep, that was just in time. I got a feeling this ninja's gonna go down to the final boss really quick. And he resists all the elements, so why? Fuck an element. You're taking the right piece, you are. Hit him like click, clack, pow. I'm just gonna keep Hilara in. I'm just gonna like temper him some more. Ow. 16 hits, and he's dead. There we go. Well done. I'm a dragon. Get to shoot me. Sorry, guys. You've all been defeated. Uh, what level are we, by the way? 47, 47, 47, 48. Okay. Um. Right, we're going into the final boss right now, so let's heal everyone up. Mm. Sorry. There we go. And let's use those ethers. Everyone is maxed out. And let's quick save, because this boss will well, I'm just another screenshot somehow. Could potentially basically wipe my whole team. Uh, that's the wrong button. Um, I am guess we're going in the middle. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh. Oh, that was very lucky, no damage. Oh. 
Ooh, are we really close to a level? No, we're not. Because look, he's level 48, he's level 48. But they're 13 and 15,000 behind. I was going to say, I could sneakily do a level or two, but... Uh, let's try the final boss and see what happens. Yep, there he is. You remember him. All right, we're going to quick save again right in front of his face so it doesn't take us 50 years to fight him again if we fuck up. Do you remember me? I was once the most renowned knight in all of Cornelia. Hey, you. 2,000 years from now, you killed me. I am Garland. Oh, you did defeat me then. But the four great forces saved me by sending me back through time. Once here, I sent the four fiends into the future. Where they shall once again use the four greatest forces to send me back into the past. It makes no sense. In 2,000 years, I will remember none of this. Bam. For he is chaos. But I will be reborn again here. So even as you die again and again, I shall return. Born again into this endless cycle that I have created. You big smelly willy. So here's chaos. He looks like he's got a mouth for sucking wang, but be careful. He does not suck your wang off. So first thing we need to do very definitely me to do is Patara because he hits like a truck the second thing we're going to need to do is temper the shit out of this brethren what's on blaze oh that was a heavy blaze now this guy has 20,000 health I'm going to use a high potion on myself. You are going to use a Hilaga, and you are going to temper this boy again. Magic is not too big of a deal with this guy. Um, obviously, the fire thing is a little different. It's kind of a, a, a monster spell, not really a magic. I don't know how it works. But our main thing is to make this boy so strong that no person can touch him, right? Uh, then we're going to haste him. Ow. Because chopping 20 grand off of someone is not the easiest thing ever. So we want to get a couple of Pataras up, basically. With our mage. And then mention the Hilaga, because he's probably going to do something stupid. Uh, then we're going to temper him again. So he's doing about 250. Which is not nice. He's doing 900. Which is still going to take 20 turns to kill this guy, but it's annoying as hell. I'm going to heal again. And I'm going to haste this boy. Ooh. Tsunami! Uh, in case you're wondering, Tsunami is a special skill of the Kraken that we never got to see in either of the fights. They each have like a special elemental power. I don't know why. Um, flare, which is magic. It's pretty powerful, but it's alright. Damn, son. Damn, son! Alright, I need to heal. Send him some more. Oh, oh, he's dead. That's not good. He went before the Hilaga and all those Pataras had got something. Um, doesn't matter though, our main hitter is still around. Uh, it means we got a swivel into a full life. Thank you, sir. Uh, uh, this round, we may as well just flare this big boy. Ow. 
<laughs> we keep stupid. <laughs> The only reason that's unfortunate is it basically means that um, uh, 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 I'll use that. Um, there we go. It, it, oh, don't go first. Thank you, sir. I don't mind you doing that, but it's fine. Well, you should have him, to be honest. Didn't I just use an elixir on Rockers and he didn't do it? Or did I... Am I... Doesn't matter. Don't worry about it. Not him! God damn it. Alright, we almost got this guy. I have not been counting X HP, but he has 20,000 of it, and we've been hitting him for almost two to 4,000 a turn. Alright. gonna be dead. Yep. Oh, that's alright, it's alright, it's alright, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Attack, attack. Full life brings you back. Fire I got all day every day bro, hit me with it, it's fine. No! Ah, oh, damn it, I went to get him up before Chaos died. <laughs> well, they put him through a blender. <laughs> they put my guy Chaos through a blender, bro. <laughs> Crimson Crunch. Bye, Chaos. Na 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 na. Something is gonna happen. They're just playing music. The time loop was severed at last. Uncle Ruckus died. <laughs> the endless struggle that raged over 2,000 years had ended, and the peace prevailed once more. <laughs> Poor Uncle Ruckus, bro. I gave my life to destroy the chaos. The light of the four crystals restored the forces of wind, water, earth, and fire. It was a mere trick of fate that had given rise to the chains of Garland, the chain of Garland's wrath. The chains. But magnified by the four forces meant to guide our world, that trick of fate also gave birth to the fiends. Fiends! <laughs> They just wanted some of that crystal crack, you know what I'm saying? Monsard had run rampant as the world sank into darkness. Okay. But that's all now past. I mean, I said that wrong, but same thing. Hurry up, your text is way too slow. With the four forces flowing as they were meant, the warriors prepared to cross time and return to the world they knew, a world where Princess Sarah, Queen Jane, and even Garland himself await. Who's Queen Jane? And Princess Sarah was like a two second character. Like, I can't wait to get back to Princess Sarah. <laughs> when was this fateful day that sent time spiraling into a loop? None can say. Bro, how slow are you supposed to read to be able to read this slowly? Like, blood, blood. I'm not even going to read that yet because like, it's going to take like 20 minutes to actually get to the top of the screen. <laughs> like, hold up, hold up, and wait for the paragraph to end. There we go. 
It seemed a cycle into which time had fallen would last forever, but the bravery of four young travellers changed that. They took the forces that filled the world with darkness and used them to bathe the world in light. None will ever recall the struggle the four endured, for the breaking of the chains mean that it never existed. Any more? Any more? But with the tales of fantasy that people tell, the memory of their deeds live on. Okay. Tales of dwarves and elves, dragons and shining civilizations that reach for the heavens, even as they fell. But why wouldn't... So wait, after we set the time, was there no more dwarves and elves and dragons? Is that what you're saying? Like, were the dwarves and elves not really there? <laughs> and now their return is upon us. I mean, the dwarves had their own little kingdom, and so did the elves. The elves were the ones we gave the Jolt Tonic to to awaken their prince, so... Why, why are they tales? Anyway. With the memory of their struggle buried deep in their hearts, they will quietly watch over the world. Remember always, the forces of the world must be used as they were intended, that the power of light may never be used for dark, and that the true crystals reside in your heart. Hmm, I wonder what they're trying to say there. <laughs> for you are a warrior who crossed time. Me? I beat Garland? <laughs> you are the bringer of the light. I'm a light bringer? Huh. What's that even mean? Just walk around with like a flashlight. <laughs> Behold, I bring light! I'm just like <laughs> shining on people in the night times. <laughs> ha, ah, the bringer of light has foretold. Yes, brother. Na, na, na. Na, 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 na. Can you do it? Yeah, we did it. Hurt up and quit it, because I want to move on. I mean, that was pretty good timing, though, if you think about it. I mean, I'm going to try and make these episodes an hour. We're at 57 minutes and 38 seconds right now. Even with all the little scuffing around and filling in the bestiary, but still, really, really, really. really. Our loss is fine, isn't it? Move. Get out the way. Move. Get out the way. I said move. Oh no. They offered our profound and heartfelt thanks for playing their game. Wow. Squenix. Okay. So we're going into Doctor Who now. <laughs> like, we're just going to fly into the bunghole of destiny. Now, I can skip this. I mean, if you think it's rude, I'm sorry, but like, go, go get the game on Steam, play it yourself. I've seen this before a million times. Um, so, I'm, unfortunately, I'm going to skip it for now because. Uh, yeah. Now we've got two saves that, saves that done it. And I mean, look, it, it's, it's two in the morning right now, as you can see. <laughs> Which is why I want to kind of hurry up at the end. It's because I need to go to bed. I got work at nine in the morning. But anyway. Anyway. We did it. We did it. Five episodes. Five hours and we beat Final Fantasy. Done. You ain't doing that in the later games, bro. Um, anyway. You can see, like, we have... Does it let me see the um, achievements? No, it does not. Anyway. Thank you for watching today's episode, the final episode of Final Fantasy Pixel Remastered here on the channel. Um, I am going to be looking to doing number two. I have one, two, three, four, five, and six all those Pixel Remasters, and I beat all of them other than six because I got bored half the way through and stopped because I kind of played these games all back to back and it kind of wore me out on Final Fantasy. Um, the reason I'm reading these needs every two days is because I can play for a couple of hours and kind of chill and I don't burn myself out playing it day after day after day after day after day after day after day, which is what I did when I um, broke my arm. And I couldn't do anything. No, I didn't have work. I just played these every day. Uh, <laughs> so, cool. We'll be playing two next. It's probably not going to be recorded until next weekend. Seeing as we only got two episodes of this recorded before we finished it. Um, then, uh, yeah. You might have a couple days skipped. 
Um, so the next, the first episode of Final Fantasy II Pixel Remaster will probably be out on the Monday, which will be like the 29th of April. So uh, yeah, be there for that. Um, that game is going to make me go crazy because I hate how it works. But thank you for watching um, and goodbye.